Good morning dear parents and students. Myself Gina and I'm class teacher of this school. So baby, today we are going to learn about forms of water. We are going to learn about forms of water. So there are three forms of water. The first one is solid, the second one is liquid and the third one is gas. So now I am going to explain you what is solid, what is liquid and what is gas. So here we go. So can you see over here the picture? Yes. Solid, liquid and gas. Now, so baby, do you know? Do you know what is solid? Solid means firm and stable in shape. So can you see over your stone, brick, ice? They all are very stable. Yes, we can touch and feel it. We can touch and feel it. And as a result, solids have a definite shape and a volume. So baby, if you cannot change the volume and the shape, it is very firm and stable. So over here you can see the picture of stone, I can see ice cube, brick, right? Yes. And they are the particles of matter are very close to each other. The particles are very close to each other. Now let's see what is liquid. See what is liquid? So liquid is something which is drinkable and pourable. For example, milk, juice, yummy yummy water. We can pour it and we can drink it. We can pour it and we can drink it. But baby, if you know, some can be drank and it comes in many different forms like oil, fuel, petrol, hair oil, even they are the in the form of liquid, right? But we cannot drink that. Yes, so liquid is something which is drinkable and portable and some which we cannot drink, they come in very different forms. So over here, can you see the picture of oil? And I can see water, water we can drink as well as we can pour it. Oil, we cannot drink it. Fuel, petrol, we cannot drink it. Now let us see what is gas. Oh, you know what is gas? Gas is a form that cannot be touched, felt, and nor it can be seen. So babies in the air balloon, gas balloon, what do we do? We fill the air. Can we see the air? No, we cannot see the air. We cannot even touch or feel. So over here, can you see the balloon and the parachute? Yes, for example, gas balloon and parachute air balloon. So there's an air inside that which we cannot see. We cannot feel it, nor we can touch it, nor we can touch it. Now it's your turn to identify the solid object. I am going to give you hints. It's balloon, ice, brick, parachute, stone. Can you tell me identify identify solid objects? As I told you, they are very firm and stable. Yes, they have a specific shape you can touch and feel it yes your answer is correct so ice cube brick and stone they are the solid object now let me see the liquid object mm, juice you are right we can drink it pour it stone mm, no oil yes Oil, we can pour it, but we cannot drink it. Uh, gas, milk, um, liquid, no. Milk, yes, we can drink it and pour it. And brick, brick is a sort of, yeah, brick is not liquid. Very nice, baby. Now let's identify that, that object. Milk, no. Oil, no. Balloon, yes, you are right. And I can see over here the smoke is coming out. You are correct. And parachute, so these are the gas objects. And inside this is a lot of air which we cannot see, we cannot feel it. Right? So today we learnt about three forms of 
water. The three forms of water are storage, liquid, and gas. These are the three forms of water. So I am Jinal signing off on the behalf of the Joyce International School. Bye. Stay home. Stay safe. Thank you for watching subscribe to our youtube channel activity sheet can be downloaded from the link provided below thank you